up, YouTube. But your boy Cobra is offering a wand for sale on Etsy. Yeah, it's a handmade wand. It's available for purchase on the old Etsy. Joseph, thank you for the $1 donation. I read your message. Keep fighting them trolls, man. There's a lot of legal shit my trolls could be in trouble for. But they're too stupid to see it. They just think I'm some stupid retard who doesn't deserve anything. And it's going to get them fucked in the end. Yeah, it's a Friday. Just chilling out, sipping on some brandy, watching some YouTube videos. Just chilling out like a rock star villain. I'm all for giving everyone else equal equality. As long as you ain't a sicko, who cares? But who am I to argue? How is it e-begging? I haven't gone live all fucking day. And some random fan is just like, Hey, Cobra, I dug your sushi review, man. Here's $42 to keep them food reviews going. Keep doing your thing. I'm like, well, thanks. And that's exactly my point. That was a shitty draw. Hold up. Of course, Cobra's got his cap gun. There we go. A little bit faster on the draw. You know what I gotta say about racism and sexism and abuse? Fuck that shit and power to the people. No, I did some laundry because I needed to do it. I've been sick with a head cold the last couple of weeks. So I washed my bed sheets, my pillowcases, and the clothes that I had. You know, that should help with that issue just nicely. I've gotten used to wearing my cap gun on my side. I'm comfortable with wearing it now. And some people look at it like, is that thing real? And I'm like, no, no, this thing. This thing ain't real. As long as you're not a sick fuck, who gives a shit? Okay? As long as you're not touching, okay? As long as you're not touching dead bodies, children, infants, toddlers, animals, people who don't consent to it, your relatives, etc., then outside of that, who cares? Okay, if two grown-ass men want to suck each other's dick and get married, or if two grown-ass women want to dyke out, who fucking cares? As long as you ain't a sicko. There's nothing wrong with kids being gay with each other as long as they're responsible and safe with it. There's nothing wrong with adults who want to be gay with each other as long as they're not creeping on kids. I mean, it's pretty straightforward, YouTube. Kids want to be transgender? I say go for it. Let them cross-dress. Fuck sickos. You know what I'm saying? Like, outside, fuck sickos. Outside of that, people are sick and tired of the stereotypes. And the assholes. And the gender-based bullshit. And the social expectations. Now, I shaved my, uh, my mustache and my goatee a little bit. And trimmed up this is for my halloween costume going as a wild west warlock i took it his i took a look at historic photos blah photos of the real doc holiday and how he trimmed his mustache plus the way val kilmore trimmed his doc holiday mustache and tombstone 
So this mustache that I trimmed is a little bit of historical accurization and a little bit of, you know, Tombstone the movie, yeah? See, look at that. I had a YouTube troll tell me to kill myself, and I'm like, I refuse. Hold up. Keep looking at your phone, boy. I'm not stalking Ellen. They want to accuse me of stalking Ellen. That's fucking hilarious. I oh, hold up, hold up. I own your sad, pathetic life. Leak more troll numbers, lol. That's what's up. Except they're not real troll numbers because my trolls are the biggest pussies on the planet. They're going to use burner numbers to text me because they're too much of a piece of shit to use their real number, dude. The only retard are my YouTube trolls. I don't give a fuck if my channel gets taken down for doxing. I'll just come back better and bigger than ever. Like, oh my god, ha ha ha. That's rich because my fucking trolls have doxed my address, doxed my phone number all the time. And then, then they want to give me shit for doxing their shitty burner numbers. Go fuck themselves, dude. Hard. Angie and Walt literally said, Cobra's not stalking our daughter. You need to leave him and Ellen the fuck alone. You heard that on Crystal Stream, you fucking morons. You heard straight from Ellen's parents, Josh is not stalking our daughter. Leave our daughter the fuck alone. You heard it from them f first. Anyone accusing me of stalking Ellen at this point is a fucking idiot. Fuck bite-sized Cobra for that matter. You haven't partied with Ellen. That's all I'm going to say on that. The fucking trolls want to sit here and accuse me of stalking Ellen. And I'm like, that's fucking rich. Because, one, I don't even talk to Ellen. Quite frankly, she doesn't want to date me, and I don't give a shit, because that's her fucking loss, not mine. And two, if her parents still want to be friends with me, despite all the bullshit, who am I to fucking argue? Angie and Walt are badass people. And three, go fuck yourselves. Christ almighty, my fucking trolls are so jealous. It's like, you know a smoking hot babe like Ellen? And even if you can't date her, you're still a cool dude about it. Oh, my God. And his fucking YouTube fame. I'm so jealous of it. No, the reason is is because they want to see me go live. And they're jealous of my fucking fame. I own the trolls, dude. And you just proved it. Seriously, the people texting me and telling me to quit stalking Ellen are the biggest fucking losers on the planet. It's like you wish you could meet Ellen and lick the dog shit out of her backyard. People have tried so hard to get my Etsy shut down and my YouTube shut down. It's because they're jealous. They're too fucking lazy to do their own thing. They don't have the fame and success that I have. Real talk. If my YouTube trolls started their own wand business and called it click craft wands just to fuck with me you know what i'm saying are youtube fans gonna send them a wood lathe to make them look just like mine oh hell no they're gonna have to spend money out of pocket to get that shit I'm out trolling my trolls just by sitting here casually laughing at them like, ha, 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 ha. It's the weekend. And what are my fucking trolls doing? How can I fuck with Cobra next? How can I fuck with King Cobra next? I know. Let's accuse him of stalking Ellen for the millionth time. 
oh, it doesn't work because it just makes them look retarded and desperate. You heard from Angie and Walt that I'm not doing that crap. And quite frankly, I don't go over to Walt and Angie's unless I'm invited. If Walt's like, hey, Josh, get your smoky badass down here. This is Walt. Bye. Quite frankly, if I'm hanging out with Walt and Angie and just chilling out and Ellen comes over for a brief minute, I ignore her. I don't even acknowledge her existence. The worst I do is bust out singing my sexy singing voice. And that's as far as it goes. Like, oops. You know, in Doc Holiday and Tombstone, it's just like, oops. I'm at that point anymore where I'm just like, I don't give a fuck if you want to date my ass. That's your loss, Alan, not mine. I'm not saying that to attack her. I'm just saying I've completely backed off. I would never do anything to hurt Ellen or her family. If she don't want to date me, that's her loss. And the fact that Angie and Walt still want to be my friend, despite the fucking assholes harassing them and her awesome and their awesome daughter, really shows you the kind of friendship me and Angie and Walt have. They're like, you know what? We don't give a fuck about your trolls, Josh. We know you're not stalking Alan. Fucking ignore them, dude. They're douchebags. It's the fucking weekend, and I'm sipping on some brandy. And it's like, hey, you know what? If Cobra didn't own the trolls, there wouldn't be a fucking King Cobra JFS subreddit dedicated to hating me. And when it gets so bad that even the people on the subreddit are like, dude, I hate Cobra, but that's too far. So they create a second subreddit. Jesus Christ, these people are losers, dude. I guarantee you my trolls ain't getting laid. My trolls tell me, you need to get laid, Cobra. You're a fucking autistic piece of shit. And I'm over here like, I guarantee you, you ain't getting no pussy. Because what self-respecting woman is going to say, hey, you know what? Here's a person that fucking harasses a 31-year-old autistic. I don't care if Cobra's got hygiene issues. I'd rather fuck him and then fuck his trolls. And that's usually how it goes. I don't care how rich you are. Rest in pieces of shit, Jeffrey Epstein. Uh, if you think the trolling was bad now, you should have seen me the other night. My trolls were trying super hard to fuck with me on my last, when I was doing a five hour live stream. They'd sit there and they'd text me while I'm streaming, like, oh my God. And the level they were, some of them went too far with it. I don't even want to discuss that on, on YouTube because my trolls are fucking disgusting. They're willing to break the fucking federal law just to fuck with Cobra. I'm like, your life is fucking sad, dude. It's the weekend. I make sure that are for women and for men. Over my customized girl, King Cobra's Fang. Okay, I have like almost 200 items. And like, you know, sometimes I stay the night at Walt and Angie's just hanging out with Walt, watching TV and bullshit in the breeze. And it's just like two kids at a sleepover, dude. It's beautiful like that. You know what I'm saying? Fuck sickos. And like I said, I don't care if Ellen Knight wants to date me. I'm a solid friend of Walt and Angie, regardless of what Ellen thinks of me. And if Ellen says, hey, I'm sick of your fucking ass. I want you to leave me and my family alone. I'll do it if Ellen's truly sick of my ass and she's creeped out by me hanging out with her parents. I'll, I'll, I'll leave but, like, at the same time, I'm like, how do your parents feel? Because if Walt likes me bes beside, besides the bullshit, then it shouldn't matter. If you don't want to date me, that's fine. But you're not going to take my friendship away from Walt and Angie. You're just not. I don't even give a fuck if, if Ellen wants to date me. Her parents like hanging out with me, and that's all that matters. You know...
You're a sad, miserable, delusional fuck, and I own your life. Thanks for watching my videos. I don't even want to respond to it. Just ignore it. I own the trolls. Otherwise, you wouldn't try so hard to fuck with me. My trolls are sickos who need to quit stalking Ellen. <laughs> You're the ones who are stalking Ellen. All the fucking trolls who accuse me of stalking Ellen. You're the ones who are stalking her, dude. The only rapist is you. Eventually, people are going to be like, you know what? Cobra's a decent guy, and we're sick and tired of these assholes fucking with him. If he won't do anything about it, we're going to do something about it. And when that happens, trolls got no one to blame but themselves. You're a stupid fuckface because you won't stop texting Cobra. Tell me to go to fucking bed. Why, why don't you get a life, dude? Why don't you make me go to bed, pussy? You ain't big enough to make me go to bed. I'm a grown ass fucking man. I'll go to bed when the fuck I want to. I'd like to see you fucking try. I would like to fucking see you try, dude. Don't make me come down there and spank your fucking. I'd like to see you try, dude. Dude, all the trolls telling me to fucking go to bed are going to get deleted. I don't going to listen to your shit. I'll go to bed when I fucking want to. The trolls just show up to tell me to go to bed and quit making videos. And it doesn't work. Fuck sickos and fuck the trolls. Brandon, thank you for your two cent donation to PayPal. Let me borrow 10 bucks. Yeah, I'm a little strapped for cash, man. Or what if I could? You're the pathetic loser because you're jealous of Cobra. I'll drink it as slowly as I want. For shout out to Worm, he loves anime and hentai. And yeah, there you go. There you fucking go. Anyways, YouTube, I'll catch you later.